Pigweeds are some of the most common summer annual broadleaf weeds in the low deserts. Although they are often lumped together, there are four different species of pigweed that are common here and more than 10 species that occur as weeds in California and Arizona. Their growth habits in response to herbicides are similar. It is easy to identify them by physical characteristics, but one species of pigweed can hybridize with another and become less distinguishable. Palmer's amaranth is probably the most common pigweed species found in this region. It's very aggressive and fast growing and can become six feet tall or higher if uncontrolled. It has one thick stem and several lateral branches. The leaves are lance shaped, hairless, and have distinctive white veins on the underside. It has flowering tassels that become stiff and spiny. This species has become resistant to glyphosate in many parts of the country, including in central Arizona. Red root pigweed is probably the second most common pigweed species. It is shorter and the seed heads are smaller in clusters and have stiff spine-like scales. It has leaf hairs on the margins and the veins are often reddish. The lower stems are are also often reddish. The species will hybridize with Palmer's amaranth and become less distinguishable. Tumble pigweed is very different from Palmer's or red root pigweed. It grows lower to the ground and has many branches that turn upright. The leaves are much smaller and narrower. The numerous stems are light green rather than red. The seed heads are small, spiny, and at the base of the leaves rather than in long terminal spikes. When mature, the branches are sticky, stiff, brittle that break off and at the ground and tumble in the wind. Prostate pigweed is very similar to tumble pigweed, but the stems are more prostrate, grow close to the ground, and become or form mats. The stems and leaves are smaller and reddish in color. Thank you very much.